to show you the uh, now closed House of Blues, Hollywood, Los Angeles House of Blues, before it gets demolished. Here's the House of Blues. Well, at least what's left of it. You can tell they've pretty much let it go at this point. Do like a little walk around here. Looks like it's pretty much been pilfered to death. And I didn't put money in the meter, so I'm gonna do this as quick as I can. At least let you get a view of what it was. This was one of those places I never really went to because parking was a nightmare. They, uh, you always had to valet park and then it took about 30 minutes to get your car out of here when, once it was done. This was one of the main entrances. This is pretty much how you came in. All the shows, they would send you down here and you'd park your car down there and uh, you'd pretty much enter down, right down that little hill. So that's the now defunct House of Blues. I don't know, did they all go down? Was it just this one? I don't, you don't really hear of any of them, so. That's the House of Blues. It'll, uh, like I said in yesterday's vlog, Everything's turned into construction. It will, uh, from what I understand, become another bunch of shithole apartment buildings that nobody will live in that will eventually get demolished because nobody's living in them. There's already plenty of open apartments in this city. Um, the influx is not what they think. Not at least, let's put it this way. The influx in Los Angeles are not the people that are going to be renting and buying high-rises. It's not those neighborhoods, so whatever. There's the House of Blues.